If you're looking for a cheap and automated place to buy your coins, check out FIFA Coins FC. Also use the discount code NIFTY for 5% off. Right guys, the Nifty Gamer here, back again. And today, I have possibly one of the best teams on FIFA, on YouTube, for its money. Now, it only cost me 5k, and god blimey, it's OP. Now, I recommend you guys go and buy this. I'm sure you all have 5k lying around. Go build it, give it a go. If you don't like it, sell it. But if you do like it, please smash the like button, leave a comment, and tell me that you enjoyed the team. So... We'll start off in goal, we have Trap. He's got 81 diving, 78 handling, 77 kicking and 84 reflexes. This keeper is OP. I love him to bits. Not as good as Julio Cesar from my last squad builder. But he is up there. He's really, really good for his money. I think he cost me 350 coins. Okay, he cost me 400 coins. But really, really good guys. Go try him out. On to the centre backs then. We have Gollum and Anderson. Anderson has 73 pace, 77 defending, and 73 physical. And alongside Gollum has 68 pace, 81 physical, and 77 defending. Both of these two were very, very good defenders. Now, Gollum has low high work rates alongside Anderson, who has medium medium. So Anderson does kind of push up to the CDM role himself, while Gollum just stays back and just acts like a brick. So, very good two defenders there, both different play styles, but I enjoyed using them. On to the right back and left back spot then. At right back we have Fernandez, 81 pace, 78 defending and 76 physical. And on the left side we have Mota, 80 pace, 77 dribbling, 73 defending and 71 physical. Nothing bad to say about them at all, other than if they had a bit more pace they will be a lot more enjoyable. The CDMs then. We have Romelu, 71 pace, 78 defending and 75 physical. He does have medium high work rates, so he definitely plays as the CDM. And Topol, 70 pace, 80 defending and 81 physical. He has medium high work rates, so he's very dis defensive as well. I found these two players to be a very, very, well, very, very good in the CDM spots. If they played in the CM, they won't be as good. Because, well, I don't know. I don't think they'll be that good. Because CM, I feel, is more attacking. Hence why the 4-4-2 formation I felt is better. On to the right mid and left mid spots then. We have at right wing. On to the winger spots then. At right mid, we have Osbilis. He is very, very good in my opinion. He's got 80 pace, 78 shot, 75 passing and 79 dribbling. His physical does let him down, but then again, that's not a big massive thing as wingers don't really get involved in this game. But as far as it goes, he is a very good player. And on the left mid spot, we have So, or Sow, I don't know how to say his name. He's got 83 pace and 80 shots, 79 dribbling and 75 physical. I found they were both very, very good wingers. Uh, although they did not get involved in the game, you knew they were there. And they helped massively in the team. It only leaves us with our two strikers now. We have Movsisian and Yilmaz. Now these two are probably the best striker pairs I've used this year. They work so well together. Movsisian, I'll just show you his stats. He's played three, scored four and got two assists. He has high low work rate so he's definitely in the striker spot. He also has four star weak foot which is really really helpful anyway. And three star skill moves, which you can't really complain about a non rare gold. And Yilmaz, 83 pace, 78 shot, and 80 physical. He also has high medium work rates. He's got three star skill moves and three star weak foot, which isn't too great. But he does. I'll tell you his uh, record. He's got three games, two goals, and three assists. Now, I liked Yilmaz. I want to try out his inform, so I'll put his inform card in and give him a go. Also, is it, I don't know whether Movsisian has an inform this year. I think I think it's last year. But if he has one this year, I'm definitely going to try it out. So that is the team. If you did like it, please smash the like button. Hopefully you enjoy this, these clips. And if I don't upload before New Year's, have a good New Year. Peace.